Hello everybody, it's me. Welcome back to another video. Now, in this video, guys, it finally happened. I think you can tell what's behind me. It happened. Skellic got Dragon Dance. Now, this is kind of a double video. Now, I was going to do these separately than I thought together. Like, they could actually make a really, really, really good team versus a Zulong lead. So, I was like, why not try this out? So, I'm actually going to be pairing it with Buzzlin. But first, let's go over the Skellic. Now, here with Skellic, we got we got our pure nimble personality. You could probably go for pure brawny now, but I'm just going to go for pure nimble. So, I don't have to put that much speed investment so I can use Dragon Dance. And here, we got Drudge, Aqua Jaws, Mega Chomp, and Primal Slash. Now, you might be wondering where's Outburst. I looked at it. And with my idea that I have in mind, Primal Slash works a little bit better, plus it costs less energy, so it, I don't have to put any energy investment into the set that I'm using. Um, of course, I will probably change this when I go to use Outburst, but anyway, here's the set. Now, it's like, when I when I made it, it was like really, 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 really generic. <laughs> like, really generic, and I was like, oh, okay. But we have 60 HP, 200 melee attack, 120 range defense, and 120 speed. 120 speed at level 50 at plus one allows you to outspeed very nimble Gobademic at, I think, what's 108 speed. Um, and 120 range defense at level 50 lets you um, give Protagon melee, melee attack, but I'm not sharded, so that doesn't happen. And I asked for shards, and no one has any, so that sucks. Plus, they're like a 1,000 GR now. And my HP is just there as leftovers that I had, and with what I'm using, you don't actually have to put energy investment um, you, Skelet can use two Dragon Dances, two Primal Slashes, two Aqua Jaws, and one Mega Chomp. Now, you might be thinking, how does this relate back to Buzzlin? I looked at it, and I remember Buzzlin got this move, Tribute. Sacrifice your remaining health to sharply lower the target's melee attack and range attack. Now, if you use this on anything that is not a Metronet or Falkyrie, we're going to be super duper good go. And this is actually the old Buzzlin anime that like, traps things and tries to kill them with, like, uh, I, I use, like, power focus and stuff, so I'm going to be bringing it back as it's my defensive one, so... I don't know how well this is going to work. Uh, we could Adaptive Tribute on a Zulong, and then they're forced to go for an E-Burst into our Rageful Plushie. Um, I'm really, really excited, and I am very excited. And, of course, Buzzlin's probably going to get its own video where it supports its entire teammates, but I really, really wanted to use Buzzlin and Skellic in the same video because I had a feeling it was going to work out really, really well. Anyway, I'm excited. Hopefully you are as well. Let's talk with the first battle. All right, and here we go into the first battle. Now, we do see the Zulong, which is literally exactly what we wanted to see. Literally exactly what we wanted to see. So we're definitely going to be leading off with the, with the uh, not Bar Blast, with, uh, with the Buzzo. Um, hopefully, he actually does lead off with the Zulong, because then everything's going to work out perfectly. Uh, and I also, my plan here, whenever I make these videos, is going to be um, one of the new Lumians, and then one of the new moves, one of the new Lumians, one of the new moves. So I did Boonary. Today, I'm going to do the Cat. Tomorrow, I'm going to do the Dog. And then from there, it's just going to be all new moves, probably one a day or two a day, depending on how I'm feeling, you know? Um, you might see, also, guys, I learned my lesson. I got sharpened. I, I learned my lesson. I literally told everyone in the comments to shut up, and no one shut it up. I did it. So, yeah, that, that's happening. Okay. Um, uh, I do like this. So, mm, Garbantis, though. Garbantis, though. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. <laughs> I'm fine. Don't worry. Okay. This is quite literally exactly what we wanted. So, now let's tribute. If he clicks Elemental Burst here, that would... I really thought I would out, he would outspeed me. I'm going to be completely honest. Oh. This is it. Okay. Okay, now we go into Skellic. Please click E-Burst. Click E-Burst. Click E-Burst. Click E-Burst. Click E-Burst. Click E-Burst. Do it. 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 I know. I know. It's tempting. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Are you being 100,000,409% serious right now? Everything just worked? Then I got burned. I still killed it. Are you serious? Okay. Bruh. <laughs> The first battle, I get the exact thing I wanted to happen, and then this crap happens. This game is not funny. It, it's it's seriously, it's not. 
You guys think this is funny? It's not. I'm going to cry. Okay? You're going to see me cry real tears. This sucks. I mean, I don't really... I don't... Yeah, look at that. That would have definitely O-Code. But I'm burned. Whatever. Fine. You'll see the damage later. Versus another Zulong lead where I tribute and hopefully I deal super effective damage because they're dumb. <sighs> it's fine. We're still dealing damage, so that's that's good, right? Okay. Well, I'm very sad that that just happened, but still, it's completely fine. Now, this is one thing I was worried about. It's Circadian. Never mind. Um, now, I was originally going to be using Outburst with this set, but then I decided to change it. Um, not really last second. I, it's, it's, I wasn't really, it's just, it, never mind. I, I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> oh my god. Yes, Skellic, go. Go, Skellic. Yes. That was, oh my god. Okay, here we go into the next battle. Now, this one, there's not actually super super effective move on Skellic besides on his own Skellic and possibly Dyborg. So, we would have to go for a tribute on Dyborg. So, this is going to be a very interesting interesting lead I think I'm going to have to choose. I think I'm going to go for my um, Kenibo lead, um, predicting the Himber lead, because they usually lead off with Himber. Uh, then I'll bring Barblast, and we're definitely going to go you. Definitely going to go you. We need this to try to beat the uh, Cephalops anyway. Try to beat anyway. Emphasis on the try. Okay. And they, also, they do have a Skelet, so they're probably going for some Dragon Dance shenanigans as well. Um, now, for our last one, I think like we can go any one of these and they'll do good. So I'll probably just go Vest because I think it's my best option. Okay. Let's do this. 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 Okay. So yeah, there's there's the Himber leads. This is good. So let's go for Clobber immediately. And hopefully we can actually Oko. I don't think we... We do Oko, which is really, really good for us. Very, very good for us. Now, I'm not sure if you would want to use Choice Scarf on a Very Brawny Cannibo. I think that's now an option. So I might go get a Very Brawny Cannibo soon. But I, I, I rallied this one for too long. And I don't... Like, I read like seven different um, um, like aggressive ones. And it's kind of dumb how many I rallied. And I didn't get the thing I was looking for. Um, okay, so I'd assume... I actually... Since Himber's dead... I have an idea. I'm going to go to Buzzo. Probably can see my idea here. Then I go into Tribute. Then go into Skellic. Then I'm going to go... He's going to Shadow Sprint. I have a feeling he would Shadow Sprint. Okay. Now, let's go for Tribute. If he goes into his own Skellic, that, that would suck. But I think right now we can actually sweep with our Skellic, but we just need to get enough plus one boosts, I think. Air Blade. So, it's a mixed Vesp? I mean... I don't think Mixed Vesp uses their blade, but... Alright, we're gonna go to Skellic. Our, our strat might work here. Now we're gonna go for Drudge. And because we need enough boosts to beat the Cephalops right now. That's our issue. We need enough boosts to beat the Cephalops. Okay, Tatab comes in. Um, This thing does not have a super effective hit on us. So, I think we're just gonna straight up hit it with a Mega Chomp. I am fairly certain this should kill. We're plus one. Please kill. Please kill. Please. Thank you. Let's go, Skellic! Oh my god, Skellic's gonna be so broken. And of course, there's also Obsidragon I have to go do, but I don't really care about Obsidragon. I'll have to go ask Arx for his, but it's fine. Okay, there's the Cephalops that we were worried about. Um, I could actually still use the Skellic, but I could just... I don't want to take damage on it right now, so let's go into Barblast. We don't have anything that can... After that, we don't have anything, any more Pivoters, so we're gonna have to play... Um, risky with the, uh, with it now, so. Soul Drain, that's completely fine. I should take that very, very well. Now, it's going for a Toxin Blast. Now, the, our, one of our best case scenarios, uh, it's just, <laughs> wait. Wait. No, he's going to Soul Drain. Had, if I, I wanted to go back into Skellic on his Eerie Stare, then I would have gotten plus two, but I did realize he's just going to Soul Drain. Okay. We took 50, then 52. Alright. Nice. Now that our biggest threat is dead, if he goes into Dyborg, please go into Dyborg and click Baneful Bash. Vesperatu. That is still fine. Because I'm pretty sure that we can just Water Bomb and sack this. Now, I saw a comment on the last video that I don't remember who it was, but why would you Shadow Sprint? 
literally hit me. If I kill you with a bar blast, there's something wrong with you. Okay, he's healing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna beat you. You, you have. Why does Vince is doing more damage than usual? Do they buff this this thing? I don't think it should be doing this much damage. Well, I could go into Skellic because it seems like he doesn't have slap down, but it said something like, um, it it was my Bunari. It's, they said something like along the lines of, oh, I forgot what it was. Uh, uh, it's good in these specific scenarios, and then sacrifices his Lumi instead of finishing the battle. And I'm like, it's for content. I want to get to use out of the new loot. This could work. It could. Hit me, hit me with a, hit me with it. Come on, hit me with it. I know you want to. <clears throat> and I'm just like, this guy does not understand what it, what you have to do to get these Lumians to work. Oh, it worked. <laughs> We're now a plus three, plus one Skellic. <laughs> this update was just a buff to Skellic, dude. I love it. I love how this, uh, this update was really just a buff, giving it, give it every buff you can to Skellic. Which is, <laughs> which is just amazing. And we're going to click Primal Slash. We're going to end off this battle. All right. Well, that worked out really, really well. Okay. Um, we did. I'm just, I'm very excited for what we're going to do later. Um, if we can do tributes with Buzzlin. Now, of course, um, the players I'm fighting right now aren't really the most talented players. Um, hopefully later when I fight, if I do fight a better player, um, which I usually try to, I can get this thing to work. And I'm very excited. Anyway, let's hop to the next one. All right, and here we go. Oops, 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 oops. Good luck and have fun. All right, and here we go into the next battle. Now, um, is he going to be tribute buzzling? <laughs> These are questions I got to ask myself now. Um, we could lead off with our Bunari, get a good anti-lead. Um, but I don't really want to. I kind of, I'm kind of feeling the blow talks lead here. Um, I do really like my Kanibo here. I think it's very, very powerful. And... I do need to save, I actually need to save my Bar Blast for, for his guard. Gar I'm, I'm going to lead off with this, actually. Um, mm, you can definitely go Skellic. Uh, where would Skellic get the boost, though? I don't think it would get the Rageful Plushy boost. And I don't think we can bring Buzzle in here. Oh, this is going to be a little tougher, I can tell. You can tell it's going to be a little bit of a tougher battle, but I think this is my... What I gotta do. Yeah, Buzz. I had a feeling he was gonna leave Buzzo. I had a feeling he was definitely gonna leave Buzzle in. Boonary. Now, one thing I don't want him to get is burned with a choice scarf. That's the thing I do not want to happen with with, with this Buzzle in. Um, I could tribute and... Oh, he doesn't have barter, actually. I could tribute and completely destroy him and then go into Kenibo. But I know Kenibo won't outspeed it. And I don't want to get Baneful Bash. So, I think I could just nosedive. Now, if he tributes, that might be best case scenario for me. Actually, he'll die to the recoil here, but I, I don't. I die as well. I die as well. Yeah, we both die. So, getting the buzzle out of the way is actually really, really good. I really, I'm actually glad with this exchange. I'm glad that his buzzle is dead. So, that was absolutely hilarious. Um, <laughs> that was absolutely hilarious. So, we could go Skellic. I think Skellic is an idea. Or I could go Bar Blast. I'm gonna go Skellic, though. Oh, there, yeah, I had a feeling Garlash was gonna come out. Okay, um, I don't, he, he, if he Primal Slashes, I get a lot of my boosts here. Like, if he's Primal Slash, I deal way too much damage to his entire, I'm gonna go for it. Primal Slash, Primal Slash, Primal Slash, Primal Slash. Wait, 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 this could work, this could work, this could work, this could work, this, don't be Choice Scarf, you're not Choice Scarf, you're not Choice Scarf, you're not, you are not Choice Scarf, 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 please, Oko, you're plus three, please, Oko, oh my god, 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 oh Okay, I outspeed it. I outspeed it. He just get range attack because I'm dumb. Okay, uh, let's go Proto, Protagon. I'm just going to go a plus three Skellic. Um, 
none of my moves, I think, kill it, which is quite unfortunate. Aqua Jaws is my strongest move I got here, so we kind of have to go for it. Let's go for the Aqua Jaws. Very unfortunate I didn't... If I do kill this thing, that'd be absolutely amazing, but I don't kill it, but the fact we did that much damage on two of his things is crazy. <laughs> Oh, okay. That was awesome. Now let's go Vesp. Now, that's, he only has two of his Lumines left, which is really, really good for us. Let's go for a Shadow Sprint. Now, if I actually had a... If I was using Piercing Drive, I actually would have been able to kill the Protagon. Um, which is quite unfortunate. I didn't want to kill it. Um, he's going to go into... Sh My brain? Hello? You do realize... Shadow Sprint's plus priority, right? Okay, I can tell that people are not expecting the Skellic right now, and that's a good thing. You do, you want to use, I, I want to use the things that aren't expected right now, which there's a lot of things that are not expected right now because Lanthus City just came out three days ago. And Pharoglyph. This is one of my good walls. Uh, doesn't this thing have Shrewd Blast now, actually? Doesn't he have Shrewd Blast though? I know this thing has Shrewd Blast. So we might use Shrewd Blast here, but that should be completely fine. Okay, so it's melee. Okay, so it's idio. Is it idio? <laughs> I can't tell if this thing's an idio. I can't tell. Is it? Okay, it is idio. Good. Okay, I was gonna say. I could not tell if that was idio or anything. But yeah, we win with Vesp. We slap down and then Shadow Spin, we win the game. Um, but yeah. Honestly, like, the Skellic with Dragon Dance is really, really scary. And I really hope um, Theo gets Dragon Dance in the future. But that's just my wishful thinking. Uh, but if you use the Tribute with Rageful Plushy. You get a guaranteed Dragon Dance, which is always really, really good. It's something, like, on Skellic, that's really good on paper. Because I think Water Ancient is, like, pretty pretty good, right? I think it's pretty decent um, as coverage-wise. I'm not sure what would resist both of those. Because, well, you need a Water Light, and then you have Mega Chomp to be. So, yeah, your coverage is really, really good on the on Skellic. So, if you get up to that plus three, you're going to be really good to go. Let's get to the next battle. So I think I got a server hop pretty soon, because <clears throat> I mean, I've been in the same server for like, oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 oh no, wait, wait, Borok, wait, 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 my, <laughs> wait, his, his Borok could utterly backfire on him here, depending on his lead here, that'd be hilarious, okay, um, Kenibo's really, really good, um, Kenibo actually breaks through half of his team, except Lumi. Yeah, we gotta be careful the Lumi, I'm thinking. We can go to Actually, we can just go Bunari on... No, we can't go on Bunari on his Lumi. Um, yet again, we can't really bring Kanibo. We do check his Kanibo with our Barblast, though. He... Okay, right now we need to beat Lumi. If we beat Lumi, we win the game, which is pretty obvious all around, but... Okay, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna lead. Let's go this. Go with this lead! All right, here we go. A little nervous on his lead. Veno lead. Okay. I don't want to get bartered, though. I don't want to get bartered. I really don't want to get bartered. I really, really don't want to get bartered here. I don't want to get bartered at all. Like, I really don't. Is it barter? Okay. Um, only adaptive, which is really good to know. So, I do know this thing's moveset now. Um, it's going to barter, and I think my best option is going to bar blast, because I do not want to lose my boots here. And I, I don't want to lose my boots. I do not want to lose them. So I'm going to go into Bar Blast. I don't want to lose my amulet. And I don't want to lose my boots. So he's going to swap actually into... Borok. Which... Is quite horrible for me. If I'm going to be entirely honest. This is quite a bad si si situation. Because um, this is worst case scenario. Oh no. Um... There is actually a really funny thing I can do, which could actually, which would be hilarious if it worked. I could do it. Depending on the speed of the Borok. I can't lose my Bar Blast, though, which is what sucks. Kanibo. I, I, I can't lose Bar Blast because then I lose to his, uh, to his Kanibo. So I'm just going to go, I'm gonna, I have to go Kanibo. I'm going to die to his attack though, but then I get to go to Bunari, copy his boast. Since I get his plus one from boast, it'll be a, a tie, I guess. But I think even if it's a tie, I, I don't know what happens when it's a tie with your attack. 
So I'm pretty sure he's just going to quick pounce here, but that's completely fine. I will just go for a clobber. Oh, he's Scarf! Well, this is going to be interesting now, isn't it? Okay, then. It's going to be very interesting. I'm very curious now. So he's a Scarf. I copy his boost. I'm also Scarf. So technically, I wonder if this will work. B boast? You know, my plan did not work. My plan was to get plus one with the Borok. Yeah, that just, this didn't really work out very well. He goes Lumi. This is fine. Um. Wait. It could work when he goes Protagon. I've, I'm gonna go Bar. And he flash and flees back into Borok, pretty sure. And then I have to Water Bomb, which I don't want to do, but I have to. Back into Borok. Back into Borok. Come on. I know you want to. It's completely free. I don't think I'm going to win this game because I don't have a good counter to Borok, especially a Scarf Borok on this team. Um, so I don't think I'm going to win this. Like, I, I, I don't think at all. Um, my only chance is here is if I live this attack and I get to Water Bomb for free, which I don't think I'm going to be able to do because I'm going to die here, right? Bar Blast. Oh my god. Bar Blast. <laughs> Bye, Borok. <laughs> bye, bye. That's the biggest threat out of the way. Okay, that's the biggest threat out of the way. Um, still pretty bad though, because he's gonna go Proto Gone, I would assume, and just kill me. I'm not sure if I can still get usage out of Bar Blast. It'd be funny if I could. Um, I still have Skellic though, and I could still win the game with Skellic. I just need to somehow chip the Proto Gone. Which, yeah, there's Proto Gone. I'm gonna save Bar Blast later for a sack for um. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna go into my Tyrex. I actually could still win this game. I forgot I had Rageful Plushie on Bar Blast, and I was pretty sure I was going to live the Earthquake. This is gonna be pretty close, but I'm of course gonna do another battle after this if I don't get much usage out of the Skellic. But I do like including these fights where I don't use it that much, because it kind of shows where it's good and where it's bad, you know? That is absolutely perfect. Now, what I want to do is double into Skellic on the Lumi. But then he just goes Protogon and I die, which I don't want to, which I don't want to happen. Actually, I could go Bunari, and then I could flash. I need Chip on Protogon, cause or I could do this actually, cause he's gonna switch into Luminami. I could actually get my Bar Blast back up to health healthness here, because it's very, definitely very sluggish, and since I'm not very sluggish anymore, I actually might outspeed it. Which would be best, 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 best case scenario, if this can actually work. And of course, I'm going to keep Skellic for later, and I can actually do a lot of shenanigans here. Okay, it's going to go into Venelin, which I... This is fine. I would rather get Shaq, because he, he can't really hit me, and I can't really hit him. So let's go for a Juvenate again. I would assume he's going to barter. Right now, my Skellic does a lot of damage. Protagon, Venelin. I need to get my Icicle Traps down, I think. That's what my my next thing should be, is getting Icicle Traps down. I'm very surprised I was actually able to get the Bar Blast back up to health. I was at 2 HP. Barter. That is completely fine. That's completely fine. I'm completely fine with this. I'm an Icicle Trap. Now, if he has Krakola, he'll go into it. But I don't think he wants to because I have Bar Blast. I'm very intrigued on my on that rageful plushy bar blast though, and I know some of you guys are as well. But that was just really funny. Adaptive, that's completely fine. Okay, now I'm gonna rest. Okay, he's swapping. Oh, perfect. Okay, so. I'm going to go back into Tyrex. I'm going to, I'm going to go back into Tyrex. He can energy surge. That's completely fine if he energy surges. If he goes back into Lumi, I'll just go back into Bar Blast. And we win this infinite battle. The more chip I get on Protagon, the better chances I have that Luminami goes for Flash and Flee. And then Krako. I knew I knew we had Krakolo. I, I knew we had it. I knew we had it. Okay. I'm going to go for an Earthquake on the Krakoloa. Because if I can kill this thing. 
Okay, right now I'm noticing how overpowered my Skellic is versus this guy, but I really need a little bit more chip and Proton because we saw how much damage we did with the uh, Aqu Aqua Jaws last time. When we were at plus like 17,409. Um... <laughs> Wait. He can't flash and flee, can he? He can't. He, he, wait, he can't flash and flee. He can't flash and flee, I just realized. He can't. He, re, he I think he knows that. I'm going to scapegoat. See what... Is he going to maroon? Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Uh oh, buddy. <laughs> I'm a Tyrex by the scapegoat, buddy. Oh no! I think Tyrex might win this, actually. I do want to get. I think that I got a lot of usage out of the Skellic, and now this is where I got to save it for later, you know? If you let me kill this, I win. If he lets me kill this, I win the game. If you let me kill this, I win the game. I win if you let me kill this. Okay, he's not going to let me kill it. I was going to say, like, if you let me kill that, I would have won the game, which would have been really funny. I'm going to sharpen. I might actually not get my scapegoat broken by two flash and fleas. I assume I won't, right? Oh, Tsunami. I'm going to scapegoat again. And if it rests, that's decent for me. That's decent for me. If it goes for another Tsunami, we both... I'm not sure what I would go for here, actually. He's going to rest. Yeah, he does. He does predict my scapegoat. Now I can... I probably should have just sharpened on the Protagon switch. Okay, I'm going to Steel Crusher. Luminami, you Tsunami. Okay, now I'm going to switch into... I could switch into Bunari, and then I can Flash and Flee, but I'll be faster than him. So his Flash and Flee will take effect first. I think... I think there's enough chip on the Protagon. I think there's enough chip in the Protagon. There could be. But I need him to go... I need to somehow switch in against the Lumi. I think I know what I have to do. It's gonna go Protagon. There's enough chip on it for Skelet to win right now. I really, really want to switch here into my Skelet and the, the Luminami Flash and Fleas. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it. Go to Lumi, go to Lumi, go to Lumi. Oh my god. It could work. Oh my god. Oh my god, this could work. This could work. This could work. This could... Flash and flee. Flash and flee. Flash and flee. Flash and flee. Please 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 flash and flee. Oh my god. It's gonna work. It's gonna work. It's gonna work. It's gonna work. Oh my god. Oh my god! It's gonna work, it's gonna work, it's gonna work. Okay, Protagon does not live. It doesn't live. We saw from before that with all that stuff, Protagon takes 88 or 73. We need a high roll and not to miss with Aqua Jaws right now. Or we go Mega Chomp and play it safe, but Mega Chomp does practically the same amount of damage. I'm gonna go for Mega. It does practically the same amount of damage, I just checked. He's switching into Lumi. I'm gonna... I won. I won the game. I, I won. There's no way I lose. I can't lose. I'm at plus four, plus two with Skellic. I, 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 I think I just won with the Skellic. Because he's gonna lose to Skellic. Oh my god. Come on, dude. Rest. Rest. He's gonna switch back into Protagon. No, Neveno. How much damage does this do to Avenalyn? 
Venelin. I need to give Primal Slash. I am now plus four. Pretty sure Primal Slash KOs. Pretty sure Primal Slash KOs. I'm gonna go for Primal Slash. It's a chipped Venelin. Oh my god. Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my god! Okay, never mind. I'm not gonna do another battle. Because this guy like, actually was able to do what I wanted it to do. Yeah, he made a really, really, really big mistake going for that Flash and Flea. And I'm pretty sure I have just enough energy to go for Mega Chomp and an Aqua Jaws to win the game. I'm gonna Mega Chomp. I don't want to have the chance that I miss because I do not want to miss. Oh yeah, I have enough. Pretty sure I have enough. Pretty sure I have plenty. And even if I don't, his Krakola nor his Luminami is gonna be able to kill me. Yeah, it, it took one play from him. It took one play from him for me to win the game. I'm an Aqua Jaws. I'm one. I knew I'd be one energy off. I looked at it. And I'm like, oh no, I'm one energy off. It took one misplay from him. It, or it took one really good play for me or one mi miscalculation from him that I win the game. I'm very happy right now, and there's no way this guy wins, because I still have Barblast and I have Skellic. There's no possible way that he wins. I was one energy off from winning the game entirely with Skellic, but guys, I am 100% going to be ending it here. Good game. Absolutely good game. Incredibly good game. I was really scared I was going to lose that game, but oh my god. That worked out so well, and I'm very, very happy. Anyway, guys, that's going to end off this video. Hope you guys really enjoyed, and I am so happy with the Skellic. You know, the, it was supposed to be the dynamic duo of um, Buzzlin and Skellic, but oh my god, I'm very happy already. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye!